Hello everyone, this is Hunter. Today I'm going to talk about the user permission. This function is designed for users with different identification have different permission level in project. For example, in this case we have three rules can log in. It is manager, technician and worker. So we directly compile and run AS simulator. So I log in as a worker. We can see that I just able to operate these two buttons, the red one and the yellow. I cannot operate but if I log in as manager then I can able to operate the only buttons so following let me introduce the setting of this user permission In these settings, we can add any users at will and check this box to delete them. And we can see this manager rule is set as admin, so this identifier can operate any object in the project. What needs to be considered is that one project can only have one admin so you can see if I want to add another one admin to this worker it, can, it cannot be done so I must disable the admin box from manager then I am able to add it to the worker after we finish in the setting, we can click save and insist to, to save the settings. The bottom object part, we click this object and access this security tab. We can see there is a box for enable the user permission and uh, then we can select different permission level for this object so we change it into worker after level is select we can click ok to finish it compile and run it again So this time I also log, log in as a worker. So this time you can see I can operate the red button now. So this is on the many content I present today about another specific settings. Please refer to our demo of user permission.